with the hot cachapa. You can really taste the corn. Oh my God. This is the most amazing thing that was ever invented in Venezuela. When you go to Venezuela, this is the thing you have to eat for breakfast. What's good everyone? This is David Hoffman from David's Been Here in beautiful Miami, Florida, my hometown. And today I'm taking you to eat some delicious Venezuelan food at Budare Bistro, one of the best Venezuelan restaurants in the city. It's located here on Coral Way, entering the Brickell Financial District. And if you guys don't know, my parents were born in Venezuela, so I grew up eating this food. We're gonna eat some tequeños, arepas, cachapas. Oh my God, my mouth is watering even thinking about it. Let's go to Budare Bistro and eat some Venezuelan cuisine. Follow me. Okay, so our first dish here at Budare Bistro is a cachapa. So basically this is a corn and flour mixed pancake with white cheese in the middle. They put sour cream on top and then they put shredded white cheese on top of that. This is my favorite thing to eat for breakfast in Venezuela. Okay, let's just dive in here. Cachapa, oh look at this. Wow, look at that. Just gotta dive in right there. Grab some. Ooh, look at that chunk of cheese in the middle. This is really one of my favorite things ever. Mmm. Oh yeah, the cold white cheese in the middle with the hot cachapa. You can really taste the corn. Oh my god. This is the most amazing thing that was ever invented in Venezuela. Mmm. I love the sour cream on top and also more cheese on top of that. Look how amazing this is. When you go to Venezuela, this is the thing you have to eat for breakfast. It's so freaking good. I just love the contrast between the hot corn pancake and the cheese. Sour cream, cheese, more cheese. Oh, I don't know how to explain how amazing a cachapa is, but you have to try it. Mm. And Budada Bistro is also open for breakfast. So come here, 9.30, have one of these, have a little coffee. Oh my God. I'm gonna have to slow down because I'm not gonna be able to eat everything else, but. Mmm. All right, I can't eat anymore, but that is one of my favorite things ever. What? The second thing we're trying from Venezuela is arepa. Now, arepa is dough, corn dough fried into like almost a sandwich. Then they cut it in the middle, take out some dough, then they fill it with whatever you want. And here, this is called the reina papiada. And this is basically, this is a mix between chicken salad and avocado. And look how amazing this looks. Wow, it's just so stuffed. When I was a kid, I used to eat this just like every day, one of these, but we used to put like deli meat, you know, some white cheese, some ham, some turkey. And here we go, first bite. Mmm, there's just something about arepa. Venezuelan arepa is very different from the arepa in Colombia, because they both have arepas. The Colombian one is like thin, thinner, and they put the cheese inside, and they actually like cook it with the cheese. Here they cook it, they fry it, they take it out, they cut it open, and then they put all the stuff inside. How fire this is. This is so freaking good. Mmm. The first time you try an arepa from Venezuela, try the Rena Piada. It's like the most famous one, but you can also just have it with some white cheese inside. Either way, it's really good. I love what they're doing with the chicken salad because it has a little bit of avocado inside. It's light on the mayo. Mmm. And again, it's a great contrast having this really hot arepa and then inside is this cold chicken salad. Oh. It's so addictive, it's really hard not to finish it. Mmm. Mom, Dad, this is for you. Oh, yeah. A secret, my mom makes these, but she makes them like very, very small, like that, like almost like a little bigger than a quarter. And she puts Parmesan cheese inside. So it's like like a little fritter with Parmesan cheese. Oh my God. I have to stop because I won't be able to finish the next few dishes. But I love it. And ask for a coffee because it's really early. It's like 10.30 in the morning right now. So I got a coffee, and this is actually Cuban coffee because we're in Miami. So, we're having Cuban coffee, a little bit of sugar, really strong coffee, 
with a little bit of milk. It's called a cortadito. So Cuban coffee, it's like espresso is the regular one, it's a cafecito. And you have a cortadito, then you have a cafe con leche, which is like 80% milk, 20% coffee. This is more like 80% coffee, 20% milk. Ooh! Like right when you put it in your lips, you feel it. It's hot. Hot and like electric. Oh wow. Okay. Now Tequeños. So the next two things I'm trying is right here, tequeño. So this is like a cheese finger, stuffed with cheese, fried. Ooh, really hot still, delicious. And here we have empanadas. And these empanadas are a little different from the rest of Latin America. They're like smaller, more refined, a little delicate. And here I have one of chicken and one of meat. Oh, they're still a little hot, just came out of the fryer. So they give me two sauces, tartar sauce and a garlic sauce. You have to have these things with these sauces. So I'm gonna put some of the sauce here inside. I'm gonna try one of these first. Tartar sauce. All these empanadas look so good. Mmm. Still really hot. Nice meat inside. Mmm. I think what I have to do though, we gotta put some of this right here. Yeah. Garlic. Mmm. Oh, I love the meat in here. It's like shredded meat. I'll try it with the tartar sauce. Oh yeah. Tartar sauce with that is amazing. Another really typical thing. So this is basically a snack in Venezuela. You can only find this in Venezuela. Tequeño. So you can see the white cheese is coming out right here. Take a bite. Mmm. If you ever go to a Venezuelan wedding, they'll have like a million of these. You stuff yourself with tequeños. Mmm. This is actually better with the garlic sauce. Wow. There's just something about Venezuelan food. I guess because I was raised with this. Mmm. Chicken one's really nice too. Mmm. Super delicious shredded chicken in here. Some tartar sauce. Mmm. And I love that these are like a little smaller. So they're like more crispy. A little crunchier. These empanadas are very different from Cuban empanadas. I like these better. As you can see, most things are fried. So, it's not super healthy for you, but it's super delicious. This is something you have to try in your lifetime. The Gano from Venezuela. Tartar sauce. Delicioso esto. Si, 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 demasiado rico. Completo. Estoy buenísimo, pero yo puedo seguir. Okay, so the last thing I'm trying here at Budada Bistro is mandongas. So this is like, so it's a sweet plantain dough, fried, like a, almost like a donut shape, right? Inside, they have cheese. This thing is so good, but it's so hot right now. Wow, my nongas. I actually don't think I've tried this before. It comes with sour cream on the side and white cheese on the side. And then right here, we have a chicha. This is like a dessert, right? Chicha is rice with milk. Mmm. With cinnamon on top. Oh my god. Super refreshing. Oh, and this Miami Heat right now? I need that. Just to tell you again, without a bistro, it's an authentic Venezuelan restaurant here entering Rickle on Coraway. They also have a second location in Weston and they serve like the most traditional stuff you can have in Venezuela. Cachapa, my favorite, arepas, tequeños, empanadas. They have these man mandungas. Mandungas? Mandrugas? Mandungas. And yeah, so let's try this with some sour cream. Mmm. Oh my god. Mmm. It's like the most delicious sweet plantain, condensed, super tight, compact into this donut. Right there, they can't even break it, look how hard it is to break. Oh. Oh my god. A sour cream, you just dip it in, get some of the cheese. Oh man, this is like really amazing. Woo! The best part about it is that it's sweet plantain, not just like regular green plantain or whatever plantain. It's so it's like extremely sweet. You have to mix it with the sour cream and the cheese, like just like that. This is the best way to do it. Oh man. And to end our incredible meal here, we're having a chicha. Mmm. Oh, so it's not just milk, it's there's condensed milk in here. Oh, the cinnamon. The whole mix here is just incredible. Budada Bistro, you're killing the Venezuelan food game. Mmm. I congratulate you because every single thing I tried was better than I've ever tried it in Miami. 
So I love every single bite. My favorite for sure was the cachapa. That is the ultimate dish from Venezuela. And if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave me a comment below, and subscribe to my channel. And next time you visit Miami and you're in the Brickell Financial District, hop on over here to Bodada Bistro. It's right here on Coral Way and 18th Terrace, really close to Brickell. I mean, it's probably like a one minute Uber drive. And yeah, you have to visit this place. It's awesome.